will be spending a lot of time alone in the Velisca Axe murder house. In here by myself now. Preacher. Preacher! It said preacher! A girl wanted to escape through! It said Whoa! Hey! What? Oh my god! Whoa. I am like. My mind is going crazy. What is up? We are back with another episode of Project Fear and we are at the Velisca Axe Murder House. We have been here all night and if you have not seen it already, make sure to check out part one. What has gotten us to this point has been incredibly terrifying. It's been crazy. Like we got the word preacher to come through two different devices, the ovulus and the PS device. It's rumored that the person who did the killing, who murdered the eight people in this house was the Reverend. And we got that word preacher to come through twice. And on top of that, just the creepy EVP that Dakota and I captured in the attic. What the f Dude, that sounds like a kid screaming, like the murder taking place. So we are about to really challenge ourselves here. Ooh, uh. Two of us will be spending a lot of time alone in the Velisca Axe murder house. Oh, awesome. I don't even know who it's gonna be yet. So Tanner is going to draw out the first letter of our names and then we will draw and whoever I select out of that hat, it could be me, it could be anybody. Great, great. Awesome. Oh. That is who will be staying alone. Time for some alone time. Unfortunately, I forgot to tell you guys, I forgot to bring the walkies. I know. <laughs> great. Dude, we don't even have walkies tonight. Like whoever's in the house, you're gonna have to scream. Oh, fantastic. Great. You gotta be kidding me. This is really great. All right, who is the first victim, Chelsea? I don't know, but all I know is I have a really bad track record when this happens. Yeah. New me. Oh my gosh. Oh Lord. I seriously. Oh, come on. I don't even know. Oh man. <laughs> I'm, so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm actually so nervous. I'm nervous. Come on. I don't like this at all. Come on. Tanner! Come on! Oh, <laughs> oh you gotta be kidding me! You! <laughs> You suck, dude. I do not like you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> that sucks, dude, but we're also in a neighborhood right now, so can we keep it quiet? Oh, good. I hope the cops come and kick us out. <laughs> yeah, then we get to go. Oh. Oh. Well, you know what T stands for. Time to get going. Time to get going. <laughs> well, why don't we outfit you with some gear and uh, get you on in there? Oh. That stinks, oh, dude. It. Nice pick. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Oh man. <laughs> Why, God? It's always me. All right, let's get you on in there. <sighs> this is so sick. Oh, I'm I so happy this. for him. I know. Well, that sucks for Tana. Oh. It really sucks for Tana. We're gonna go set up two cameras inside. <laughs> All right, Tanner. All right. Good luck. See you guys. Do you have your you phone? I do. Good, because you don't have a walkie, so. It has 10% of battery left. That's okay. good. Nice. Well, if you need us, call us. Okay, <laughs> bye. See ya. Hey, dude, good luck. Yeah, thanks. Well, I'm cranky. This sucks. Anytime Chelsea draws, she just picks my name. by myself now. Everyone else is gone. It is just me. Um, I know that I am a stranger. I know that you don't know me. I don't mean any harm. So please
Please don't harm me. Walking into Lena and Ina's room. All right, so I'm in Ina and Lena's room. The still injured kids who are just over to have a sleepover with their friends. They're in this bed and were tragically murdered in a heinous crime by someone who got away. I'm gonna break out the PS device and try to make some sort of communication with them. What the fuck was that? Hello? I just heard knocking. Can you do that again? What the f What the f It might not look like I'm freaking out, but I'm freaking out. This is the PS device. It has a word database system inside of it. So let's give this a shot. All right. Ina and Lena, just wanna say that I'm so sorry for what happened to you. I've been in this house before and I'm getting the same feeling I got last time where it's just a sick to your stomach. Just knowing that in this space, an eight year old and an 11 year old were brutally murdered. Like I am sitting in the middle of one of America's most disgusting crime scenes. Female. Female. I'm talking to a female. Am I talking to one of the still injured kids? Do you have any words you like to say? Anything you'd like to say about what happened that night? PM. PM. Evening. This happened in the PM, it happened in the evening? Right. Right. You're telling us to be careful and that you hide when the bad person's here. Should I hide? Should I not be here alone? Tana's inside. Yep. Stop this solo. I'm chilling. We're just gonna be chilling. <sighs> yeah, if anyone's wondering where we are right now, we're in the barn, <laughs> which is across the path from uh, the old house there. Kind of weird that we don't have walkies and we can't communicate with him. I know. You just want to walkie scare him. Stop trying to pretend you want to communicate. Scare him. I need to make sure he's okay. Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> if you missed the last video, a cat scared us, and now we've just been hanging out with him all night. We named him Egg Roll. Mm hmm. So. Can we get some love in the comments for egg roll? Egg roll. <laughs> oh, it's been such a creepy night. Mm -hmm. We're told that the, the preacher, like double confirmation that the preacher was the killer possibly. It's almost like he frequently visits the house. We were told by the spirits that when the, the killer shows up, they hide. I'm just worried for what's gonna happen now that people are going in alone. Oh, I guess we can kind of just kick back. Let's kick back. Just pet a cat. Pet a cat. Do you want to come to Las Vegas? Purr if you do. Oh, purring. Purring. Dude, we have to keep this cat. Look at that. Just wants to play with you. So now I'm about to move upstairs.
Is anybody up here with me? God, I don't know what it is, but something is making me just feel really anxious right now. It is a weird feeling up here. This is the actual mark from the ax. All right. All right, I am now sitting in Mr. and Mrs. Moore's bed. Uh, this is where the parents were, were struck. And right behind this camera right here is the attic. I'm so anxious right now, like, uh, like my heart is racing right now. I do not, I do not feel good. Josiah and Sarah, I'm in your room right now. I would like to talk to you, I have a device in my hand. Casket. Casket. Like, I mean, this is, this is, where they died. This is their their casket. This is where their remains were. Josiah, do you know any person that would want to do this to you? Can you tell me who might have been angry with you? footsteps. Hello? I can't tell where that came from because like everything shakes in this house. I don't know how to explain this other than it feels like something is getting closer. It just feels like something is stalking you. It is getting closer and closer. Where do you want me to go? Slowly. Slowly. Something is slowly coming towards me? Stock? I literally just got done saying stock. I literally just got done saying it felt like something was closer, that something was stalking me, and I just got stuck on the PS device. Who is stalking me? Hunting. Hunting? Who is stalking me? Am I talking to the killer right now? Rest. Rest. I'm not going to rest. I'm not going to lay down. I feel like whatever is stalking me, whatever is following closely behind me is wanting me to lay down, waiting for me to pass out. Exactly how the murders happen. It wants me to rest, it wants me to lay down. Is the killer here? Well, I hope Tanner's doing okay. I think he's doing fine. I'm not even worried about it. <laughs> I hope he's like okay, because I have not seen a flashlight for basically the whole time. <laughs> I know, we don't have walkies. And it's really hard in a panic moment to dial a phone number. <laughs> oh yeah, no way. Why don't we cut back to him? Let's cut to Tanner right now and see what he's doing. Let's pull him up in a little mini square right above us. Right, right above there. us. There's Tanner right, yeah, right there. there. Oh my god, what is he doing? What is he doing He's right that now. scared? He's got the PS device flipped upside down. What a so, well, nut. Nope, that's just us. The oh, right. Okay, it's backwards too. Don't go in. Let's get rid of that guy. Yeah. Yeah. 
Anyway. Oh, what's on everyone's mind? Jenga. This cat. This Subway is another one on my mind. The system, not the restaurant. I wonder what dinosaur tasted the best. Probably Bronosaurus. Bratosaurus. Probably Bratosaurus. It probably tastes like brats. Probably brats, yeah. Oh, I really don't want to spend time in there by myself. No. So who do you guys think killed the family? Who do you think was the murderer? I, I think, think it had to be the Reverend. Yeah. He admitted to Often, it. But... We've gotten so many responses through our devices indicating mm -hmm. that. Hey. Oh, hi, cutie. Yeah, hey. jump on over here. Oh, yeah. wow. You want to come to your, your little daddy? Someone make an egg roll uh, Instagram for us, please. <laughs> please. I've been in here for a while now. But I think I'm going to spend the rest of my time in the attic. Something in my gut is telling me to go into the attic. I've been terrified of this room since I was a kid. Uh, this would be a perfect time for you to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Because why not? Go team, right? This is where they found cigarette butts in this room. It is said that the murderer, the killer, sat in this attic for hours and hours, waiting for the family to fall asleep. Is there anyone in here with me? Religion. Religion. Wait, religion, the preacher. The first word I ask is anyone here with me? It's religion. We've been getting preacher this whole entire time when we talk about who the murderer was. You just said religion. If this is the preacher, if this is this religious man that we are talking about, can you tell me that you are the preacher? Why did you kill these people? Why did you kill this family? Preacher. preacher! It said preacher! Please get this. It said preacher. Oh my God. We just got religion and we got preacher. I have the full body fucking chills right now. I am like, my mind is going crazy. You are a man of God that is supposed to speak the good word on how to better your life. I don't understand why you would take six innocent children's lives from them and cut it early. Like you are not a man of God. I hope it tortured you and you did not stop thinking about it. You do not deserve peace. Hidden, hidden, stay hidden. That was our thing. Stay hidden, stay, hide. Do you want me to hide? I'm not afraid of this man anymore. I've been in every single room. I've gotten some activity and I think I've done my solo justice. And I've been in here for a really long time. 
He's definitely coming out. Yep, yeah. he's coming out. All right. Yo. All right. What? How did that go? Okay, I finally get to the attic and I just like sit in there and it goes religion. Oh and I go, I can, I can at least go like, hey, like we've gotten preacher before and not, not even like three seconds later, I get preacher. You got oh, preacher? I got preacher. Again. I got preacher again. And I just was like, oh. Oh. So now I'm, yeah, I'm done, done. The third done. preacher what? tonight. The third, third preacher. Time. The hell. Plus the word religion. We've never had a word come through three times in one way. No. Dude, it was weird being in there by yourself. You definitely did over an hour, almost damn near hour 40. <laughs> did I? Yeah, I did. Dude, I was tweaking balls in there. Well, yeah. you want to draw? Do the next person? Yeah. Oh snap! Which one of you suckers is it gonna be? Oh my gosh! Okay. Oh, I'm so glad to be done. Let's go. Let's see who it is. New approach. What's it gonna be? Oh shit! I see a loop. It's either Dakota or Chelsea. Oh, that's not an A. <laughs> no! Oh, it's you! Damn it! <laughs> It's a D! It ain't a C! It's a D! Dude, uh, you love ghost hunting. Mm. So it's only fitting that it's you. Uh, well, excuse the bleeps here, but f my f f f pussy. F <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Good luck. Anything else you need from us? Uh, did you enjoy your evening? I enjoyed my evening in here. All right, see you guys. Have a good see one. Good luck in there. We're totally not going to be asleep. Don't forget your walkie. What? Don't forget your walkie. No. Nah. <laughs> Hello everyone, we wanted to press pause real quick to thank Rocket Money for sponsoring today's video. I recently found out that I was being charged for a subscription for a streaming service that I used to love, but just haven't used in forever. Thanks to Rocket Money, it was simple and easy to see that I was still being charged and was able to make a cancellation. Rocket Money is the financial app that helps you cancel subscriptions, lower bills, and manage your money better. I personally love ghost shows. And when I found out that my favorite ghost show was being canceled and not renewed for a fifth season, Rocket Money came to the rescue. Rocket Money safely and securely identifies reoccurring charges and cancels subscriptions for you. You can even cancel within the app with just a couple of taps. You just tap to cancel, done. To save more and spend less, join the over 5 million members that are using Rocket Money today. Go to rocketmoney.com slash project fear or click the link in the description to get started for free. That's rocketmoney.com slash project fear to get started for free. All right, let's get back to the video. In the living room right now. I'm gonna go into Ina and Lena's room for a second. Is there anybody in here with me? I'm all alone. So before I even go upstairs, I'm gonna attempt to do spirit box here in the living room on the first floor. We haven't used the spirit box yet tonight. This is a device that scans the radio frequencies at a rapid rate, and it's believed that spirits can use their voices to chime through. Okay. If there's anybody here, I have a new piece of equipment you can use this. Can you tell me who I'm talking to right now? Do you have a message for me while I'm here all by myself? I hate using this device because it's so loud I can't hear anything else around me. 
Can you tell me who was responsible for murdering everyone in this house? So like a guy saying like me? Did you say me? Oh, yeah. I heard oh yeah right away there was a male voice that said oh yeah. Lena are you still here? We thought we were talking to you earlier. It just went silent, and then a male voice came through, and he said, like, it said something. Is the preacher here? Is the reverend here? Yo, I don't feel alone. Hello? I feel like something, someone's just like watching me right now. I'm really uncomfortable. <sighs> okay. Who are you? Cause got a I heard he's got a. Male voice said he's got a. He's got a what? I'm only getting male voices to come through, which I don't like because it makes me think I'm talking to like the killer, not the family. Wait. Wait. So we can. So we can something. Wait, so we can be what? Who's the male voice that I keep hearing? Is this the killer? I'm fine. I'm fine? The find. That's a come find. Like, come find me? Is that what you're trying to say? Come find you? Do you want me to go upstairs? Kitchen. Kitchen! You want me to go, you're in the kitchen right now? said kitchen. I said, where do you want me to go? Kitchen. Oh. Okay. I'm in the kitchen right now. Guys, I'm really... I really hate this. I have like the weirdest gut feeling. <sighs> you stirred things up for Dakota. I did. I got a little angry at the preacher at the very end too. <laughs> My bad. That is really wild though. I've got preacher again. Preacher. And the word religion. Knowing Nakota's luck, the preacher, the reverend, will actually be in the house when he's there and yeah. he'll be like... <laughs> Dude, I was hearing footsteps the entire time. Like Ooh, something was trying so like creepy. someone was trying to get closer to me. Ugh. It was so creepy. I don't like that. 
Come on board. Yep. Feel that? Little egg roll. You're just the cutest. Did you guys ever have a lava lamp? Mm-hmm. These are so sick. I love lava lamps. All right, you asked me to come in the kitchen. I'm gonna keep playing this. Are you in here with me? What happened here in the kitchen? What did you do in here? I mean, this is the kitchen. It's known that when the killer was finished, he made himself a meal and hung out in here. He said to come find you earlier, and then he said kitchen. Are you still here in the kitchen or are you somewhere else? Room. Room? What room? Where'd you go? If you're upstairs, can you stomp or make a noise? Okay, I'm not really getting anything here in the kitchen, even though there was a voice that told me to come here. But I'm gonna head upstairs, explore that a little bit, and then maybe do more spirit box up there. All right, I see the other camera. So, right in front of me, this is the parents' bedroom. And this children's room in front of me here where the camera is, there's a closet in that room, and that closet is famous for opening and shutting. I thought I just heard something below me now. Back on the first floor. Yeah, I'm hearing movement. Okay. That was freaking loud. I don't know if that came from the kitchen or the living room, but that was a freaking loud noise and I know that camera captured it. Yeah, I'm hearing movement. <sighs> I'm going back up. I don't know, I don't feel like right now I'm talking to anything nice. I don't know what that was, I just went down there to check out the noise. I'm scared to actually turn on the spirit box now because it's so loud. And right now I feel like I really need to hear everything around me. If you're downstairs, can you make another loud noise down there? Spirit box would be so creepy in there. <laughs> by yourself. Oh, heck no. Dude, I hate having so a spirit box by myself. So scary. 
You get, like it takes away all of your like surroundings. Like you can't. No, no. Dude, some like fully loaded nachos right now. Oh my gosh. Taco wow. Bell quesarito. And Nacho fries. Nacho fries would be oh, good. Oh, taco bell. They're right up there with ham and cheese hot pockets. Pizza rolls. Yeah, pizza I used rolls. to eat those all the time. Oh, they're so good. I love pizza. I actually thoroughly enjoyed the breakfast toaster strudels. We're fucking hungry, huh? I'm yeah. so hungry all the time. What do you think, egg roll? Someone just dropped off a platter of egg rolls right now. It's so good. Yeah. I don't have too much time left, but I'm gonna bring out the spirit box now that I'm up here in the children's room. Can you tell me why people are capturing this door opening and closing? Door. Door? Can you open the closet right now? Death. Death. Why do you keep saying words that are trying to scare me? Who's this male voice that keeps talking to me? The fuck was that? Oh my god, it's a train. <sighs> What's the heaviness, the darkness that I'm feeling right now? If you're hiding, can you please come out and talk to me? Hey! What? Yo! Hello? That was fucking loud. Hello? Tanner? Alex? It literally sounded like someone was running up these stairs. Whoa! Hey! What? Whoa! Hey! What? Hello? sitting back down. I literally thought like Chelsea and Alex and Tana were coming in here to like scare me and then tell me to be done. Who was that? I don't want to turn on the spirit box now because I'm so freaking scared. And that's so loud. Who just ran up the stairs towards me? Who could be? It's just a girl just said, Who could be? Who could it be? That was the first female voice I've heard all night through this. Are you trying to scare me by rushing towards me? Is this the reverend, the preacher? Can you tell me that who you are? Offer. Offer. What what does that mean? I'm not offering you anything.
What was that? It sounded like a girl like crying. Oh, I'm not feeling good. All right, I'm getting out of here. Okay, I've been in here for over an hour. I'm getting out. Nothing wanted to tell me who it was, what it was, but it sure as hell tried to scare me. Oh my God, dude. I don't know how you did that. Is that creepy? <laughs> Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I had the spirit box on the whole time and I only got a mail to come through. Yeah. The loudest thing ever that scared me was, like it sounded like someone just coming up the stairs. Through the spirit box, I could hear it. Charged the stairs, didn't Whoa. see anything. And it was not the children, it was not the Moore family. Like, it was a male voice only coming through. And I think you pissed something off. I did. Because something was like running at me. I got a little upset when I like got a triple verification that it was a preacher and it probably pissed it off. Well, we got like an hour till the sun comes out. Yeah. What's the game plan? So because you had activity on that second floor in, that, in the children's room, I do think we should go visit that area together as a group. I almost feel like we should do like the Estes method, like someone should go under. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, Alex, you're the only one that you're has You're the only one too. Gone in. This is your big pick, you know? Do it for egg roll. Jeez, I'm so scared. So, will we split up into two groups? One person will be downstairs on the couch with the headphones on, blindfolds on, fully under for Estes method, and then three other people will be upstairs in the room above um, asking questions. I like it. Who do you want here? Probably Alex. Dude, nice. what the hell? Nice. Why not you? You don't want to do it? No. If you're gonna be by yourself while everyone else is still in this house, you'll be fine. Yeah, but this this feels like a personal attack. <laughs> this doesn't feel like fate. You know I'm doing it because you're the bravest. You're the no, best. you're not. You're doing it because you don't want to do it. Good okay. luck. Okay. Awesome. Jumping right into it. <laughs> All right. Let's just get right on into this. All right, we'll be upstairs. All right. Blindfold is on. Here we go. We are in the children's room right above him. This is where I just was. He can use our friend downstairs to talk with us. He can come through the device he has and answer our questions. In house. In house. In house. Who's in the house? Is the spirit of the killer here in the house right now? You. Us? You, you are here, I don't know. Okay, what are you trying to say to us right now? Is it true that the children hide whenever you show up? It could be. It could be. I mean, I said, is it true? Run! Run? Run. I just said, is it true that the children hide whenever you come here? It could be. Run. Are you giving us a warning? Challenge me. Challenge me. What do you say to the people who think that Reverend George Kelly is responsible for the murders? Dude, I think it just said Tanner's name. What? Why? What? Said something Tanner. I mean, you did just come in and like provoke kind of. Did you ever say your name? No. I mean, you guys have. 
You've definitely said your name tonight, but I don't I like to, for it to know your name. That's very smart. Why did we get the word preacher three different times tonight? What does that mean? Stop. Stop. It doesn't want to talk about it. Don't ask. Don't ask. Right there, say it. It doesn't like the fact that it's being called out. Guys, these are all a male voice too, by the way. If this is the same person talking to him as me, it's not gonna be very direct. If we are talking to the killer, what made you commit these crimes? Stay there. Up here, stay in the children's room. Stay and see. Stay and see? Wait, what? Is something gonna happen to us? Stay and see what? What's gonna happen if we stay for a little longer? See him. See him? See him? Guys, this is a different voice. There's a different voice? Dude, it just said hide! It just said hide! What? It said hide! It said hide! A girl voice just came through and said hide! A girl voice just said hide! Oh, shit! Oh, my God! Dude, it was a male voice the entire time up until then. We were told earlier, like, she tells us to hide when the killer's showing up. And you're telling me it was all male voices until that last one? All male voices until those last few phrases there. That's so freaking scary. Okay, well, do you want to keep going under or what should we do? I kind of want to hear it out loud. Yeah. Like, maybe we just stay down here? And do spirit box? I think we got to stick with spirit box. Okay. Let's do it. Just gonna do spirit box here in the, the living room where we kind of started the night and see why we're getting the word hide right now. We're not taking the advice. No, we're definitely Just... not hiding. Why should we hide right now? Your name? Your name? Could have been the dad. Could have been Josiah. Josiah, was that you? Whoa. Dude, like what the hell was that? Ugh. Is that Nina, are you hiding right now? Whoever that was was like telling us to protect the ones we love. Mm -hmm. Like we told us to hide, told us to protect the ones we love. I feel bad if the story is true that like the spirits who actually lived here and stayed here, even in the afterlife, they're still living in fear. It's like they're in a loop. This is the most terrifying, horrific, residual thing to have happen over and over and over again. 
that girl scream, like knowing that Alex, you got hide, and then we turned this thing on, like getting a girl to scream like that instantly, it like sounded like it was happening again, like the murder. I'm gonna keep playing it. I protect them from something. Another protection sentence. Do you not want to talk to us? Whatever it is, doesn't want to answer any questions about specific details. And it's like only, the only time we get answers is when it's like the family coming through, like mm -hmm. Lena. But it's never the actual killer revealing anything. I do feel like we found out a lot. I feel like we connected with Lena, who I don't know if we connected with last time. Mm -hmm. Me personally, I hands down think it's the preacher. I mean, we got... Reverend twice the first time we came here, and we got Preacher three times. I don't think the darkness that's here is anything demonic or no. evil. No. But the Preacher was evil, and that evil presence is still here. Preacher! Preacher! No way! This place will always scar my heart. Mm -hmm. It will always just be one of the most heavy locations we will ever go to. Yeah. Tonight we... We really got a lot, and I think we painted a better picture of the haunting here. Nice job, everybody. Yeah, we made it through another night. We did it. Another crazy haunted house. Jeez. Just one stop left. It's Tanner's stop, Tanner's haunted house oh, yeah. pick. Let's just say it deals with a tragedy, and it also deals with something, some Satanic ritual stuff. Oh god, great. What? <laughs> Dude, what? Yeah. Jeez. It's not good. It's it's not good. I'm very glad to be leaving Velisca, but I'm a little sad that we're leaving that cute cat behind. I know, egg roll, cute man. Cat. Oh, that's another cat, another Velisca cat that we fell in love with. And just breaking my heart. We love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. We got one more stop on our haunted house tour, and you're not going to want to miss it. So please stay tuned. Yes. Join the Fear Club. Yeah, I'll also join it. For, don't forget to uh, comment below where the rubber duck is. There is a hidden rubber duck in this video. I just promise. Just one. one. And did you know if you like the video, it makes you cool? It does make you cool. Like instantly. Does. All right, well, see you guys.